Hi, I'm Dr. Sindura Bandi. I'm a fertility consultant at Cloud9 Banjara Hills. Well, to begin with, in fertility, there are three kinds of treatment majorly used. That is ovulation induction, that is IUI and IVF. In all of these fertility treatments, what we focus on is, you know, trying to get more than one egg. Now, why is that so? When we try to get more than one egg, it's like we are giving sperm an option. If not one egg, then it has an option of another egg. So that's how we plan the fertility treatments. This is why if you see a lot of them, you know, whoever is going with the fertility treatments, they come back saying, we have twins. This is the reason, because when you have one egg you have one baby when you have two eggs there is always a chance for twins when I say with ovulation induction the success rate is again 5 to 10 percent how do you ensure that you are in that 5 to 10 percent if you take 5 to 10 percent is quite less actually but how do you ensure most of the population fall into this category you have a very good chance at you know falling pregnant just with an ovulation reduction i would again focus on exercise and eating healthy here just maintain your hormones under check and improve the quality of eggs that way your success rate increases even with ovulation induction how is the ovulation induction done? Your fertility expert will assess what kind of medications to be given in that month. The entire aim of ovulation induction is to get more than one egg. Maximum, we try to keep it to two, not more than two in most of the cases. We don't want many babies. If there are three babies, we don't want to go beyond that. So we stop at one or two. Now your fertility expert will decide what is the dosage of medications to be given, whether to give you oral, whether to give you injections, that decision depends on your fertility expert. And so meet your fertility consultant and discuss your choices and how to go about it.